What's going on guys? So I found a very cool product. Uh, I actually found two. One of them I've been using for a while. But this one I found today. The other one I'm probably going to get shamed for. And I'm not going to do a video just on that yet. I'm going to uh, get a little more information before I do the video. But it's another product that I've been using on all my mini bikes. But we're going to talk about this one today. So best bang for your buck. I mean... You're not going to want to be recording videos with this really while you're driving, but the best bang for your buck, I mean, you could, I just did, and, that, and I'm going to show that video um, maybe an hour after this one, hour or so after this one, I'll post it up, but the best bang for your buck so far, my, for me so far, at the Dollar Tree, um, no, I'm not sponsored by Dollar Tree or anything like that, uh, you know, everything that I, that I have or buy or put on my vehicles, my mini bikes, I mean, I, I pay out of pocket all on my own, everything. So that's why it may take me a little longer to do certain things. But anyway, let's get back to this. Uh, this is a bike phone holder that will hold onto your handlebars um, for a dollar. I mean, you cannot beat it. Now, I know some of these uh, phone holders, man, they'll go for anywhere from upwards to 15 20 i've seen some for even about 30 dollars and this thing right here for a dollar i mean if you wanted to watch your miles per hour if you wanted to watch your distance um you, you know and stuff like that or it, some of these um gps things even do quarter mile times and eighth mile times if you want to watch that and have it on your phone this right here for a dollar you can't beat it go to your local dollar tree and um uh, they should have them in stock. Now, I looked online. They sell stuff online. They don't have them online. The Dollar Tree doesn't. But um, check your local Dollar Tree. See if they got it. Uh, it's a really good product for, like I said, just for a dollar. I mean, you can't beat a phone holder that actually works for a dollar. I probably, I bought, I've got, I bought one extra, so I might give one away and figure out how to do it yet. But I probably just give one away to a random person. Uh, comments, comments in the video or shares a video. Uh, but check to see your local Dollar Tree. See if you if you got these in stock. Uh, show it on the bike. Uh, there we go. I know I'm saying oh, a lot, but I mean, this is how it works. I mean, you kind of just strap your phone into it. And I probably should have brought another phone out, but it cradles in here pretty much and let me just disconnect it real quick so you guys can check it out a little bit better but that's all there is to it i mean it holds and the other video that i'm gonna be posting like i said in a little bit is actually a little ride video of it me taking bumps and turns and my phone not falling off i, I think i hit about uh 40 42.9 miles an hour with this bike and it held up just fine it's got you know some grip here I it's for a dollar you can't beat it uh because i've been meaning to get one of these for a while now and uh let's see if i can do this one-handed i've been meaning to get one of these for a while but i just haven't just haven't in me to spend freaking twenty dollars for hold on bear with me guys but it really it's super easy when you got both hands and you know and then you just put it here and you tie it to your liking tight there you obviously could tighten it a lot tighter and then you just sort of just place your phone in it it's gonna be that easy Let's see if i could do this without actually turning the freaking phone off but boom and move that out the way and there you go you are on the phone hold on a second because Boom, you're on. Now, obviously, when you, there's going to be some shaking. So, like, I'll start the bike up now. You'll see. But, you know, it's all rubber. So, I mean, it's going to shake. There ain't nothing you can do about that. So, like I said, if you're, if you're buying it to, to uh, record videos with your phone, unless you got a really good phone that has a stabilizer. Hell, mine might have it. I don't even know. But...
like I said, best bang for your buck for a dollar. If you want to get a phone holder and not wanting to spend a crap load of money on one. Which, which I shouldn't be cheaping out. But usually I'd like to spare no expense on some of the stuff I buy. Uh, but I don't know. Phone holder does what it does holds the phone i mean it doesn't move around as much i mean this could be a lot tighter you could tighten it more but for a dollar really can't beat it so like i said if you're looking for an inexpensive phone holder check out the one at dollar tree for a dollar you can't beat it and i'm probably like i said i don't do product videos that aren't really really mini bike related but there's another one that's really good, and uh, I really can't wait to share that one with you guys. Because uh, I've it's a product that I've actually been using in my engines that I get from the Dollar Tree. And I've been using it on a lot of them, and it works just fine. So, like always, wear your helmet when I don't. Here's my little product review of a little sim simple cheap item so if you have multiple you have multiple bikes it's really great you know you could put them on every bike that's what i went and did i went and bought one for every bike that's so i'm having to pull it off and switch it over or stuff like that but like i said where you humble what i don't see you guys later have a good one